Today, federal and state lawmakers in Henrico County taking a look at what schools might look like when they reopen in just a matter of weeks. The U.S. Secretary of Education, Miguel Cardona, Congresswoman Abigail Spanberger, and Governor Northam took a tour of Glen Allen High School. Tonight on Your Side at 6, Henrico reporter Karina Bolster spoke with the trio about how students and staff will stay safe. Karina. Well, Kurt, today was their chance to see how a large school district like Hen Henrico plans to bring back thousands of students into the school building. But even more important was their chance to hear from those student and students and staff directly. Thank you for what you've done, for what you've sacrificed. How many of you are excited for a, a school year ahead? How many of you are looking forward to it? Woo! I'm sure you are. It's a feeling many are looking forward to, just being inside the school and seeing fellow classmates. I'm really excited to like be yeah, a part of clubs now and have a lot of social interaction with others. Many teachers saying virtual learning left them finding new ways of connecting with their students. The relationships were 100% the most important thing this past year um, and kind of developing those and getting to know your students. But now those relationships will happen face to face, even if they are behind a mask. Yes, we have masks on, but you know what? We want to keep you in person as much as we can. The U.S. Secretary of Education saying the best way to do that is to get the community vaccinated. We're all in this together and um, reopening schools means that we're lowering spread in the community, right? So if we can control the community spread, it's a greater likelihood that we're not going to disrupt the learning for our students. They deserve to be in the classroom, on the fields, without disruption. We need to do our part. But after a difficult year, Henrico staff also brought up the need for emotional support. I know as a father of two high schoolers, they're very influenced by student leaders in their school. And when you're a student leader and you have, when you're saying something, they listen. So you have such an important role, but more important this year than ever before. We have invested a significant amount more money for more counselors in our schools, but, but to have that access where they are able to talk to other students peer to peer, it's so, so important. Meanwhile, a spokeswoman for the Republican National Committee calling the secretary's visit here in Henrico a distraction as crisis unfolds in Afghanistan. Live and on your side in Henrico, Karina Bolster, NBC 12 News.